against fifth-ranked Ed Scott for NC State. Scott coming off the first All-American season of his career, was fifth in the country last year. And Rock, he's only lost twice, both of those in sudden victory this season. And when asked about team, Coach Smith said he's, he's tough. Now, T, Travis has got to be careful because Ed Scott likes to go underhook. And underhook oftentimes lead to headlocks. Action on the line, men. Work center. Action here. And an early stall against Travis. Work in the middle. Stall for backing out. Did you ever want to see that be a point? You know what? Uh, I, I've had conversations, and, and one of the things that that was brought up was perhaps having having the out of bounds, the back and out neutral out of bounds, maybe having it as something Provide outside position. the stalls, like the cautions. Don't know if that will happen, but sometimes people are hesitant to call regular stalling because they don't want someone to back out. Right, we're working in the middle here. Yeah. Both sides, both sides. Both sides are going to be first guys. Let's do it. Good quick defense by Ed Scott. No control here. And one of the things that Travis did, he tried to stay no center. Here. As Ed Scott was trying to get an angle, Just get up. Travis Just stayed get up. right in the middle of his chest. Work in the middle. T. Travis opened this year at 149. Since bumping up to 57, he's 4 0. Last year, wrestled in open tournaments, a red shirt before that, coming out of two different powerhouse high schools. Father Tolton High School in Columbia, Missouri, and then finished off his career at Stillwater High School, one of the best in the state. Good low shot by there. No Travis got to get to get his head. One chance to illegal. Little, little tough situation looking for neutral danger. Neutral danger is when. Danger one. Little roll through action by Ed Scott. Neutral danger is when one of the here. wrestlers from a neutral position, their back is over 90 degrees. Stop. Stop. And the official will give a count. What happens if a neutral danger? Neutral if danger. you're in a neutral position and your back is breaking 90 degrees, the official will make sure it's been established and then he'll say, Danger and say the caller who's right. danger and then make that three count. So Work a lot of people think it's three seconds, but when you add up the time, it's really a little over four seconds. Improve here. Ed Scott is wrestling a pretty hard pace, but Travis is doing a good Work job of, of holding against someone that's a returning All American and, and continues to move forward. Sure. A really good year, year last year for Scott. Finished 24 Three, 9. Two, two, two years removed from an ACC title after last year he lost in the conference semis. Pat Papalizio, 12 years in. They finished in the top 20 at NCAAs for nine straight seasons. And the last two years, 10th or better. And from 2015 on, Brock, you know how impossibly difficult this is to be in the NWCA top 10 in all of the polls since Green December of 2015. Not only is it difficult, but he came into NC State without any real wrestlers that, that were there to build. His first year was heavy walk-ons. Oh, my goodness. So he really built this program. He didn't inherit a program that had lots of blue chippers. He got the blue, blue chippers to come in and believe in his vision. An assistant at Sacred Heart, and then Army, and then American, head coach at Binghamton, and now NC State after wrestling for John Smith. It's a good shot there by Travis. He's got a chance. He's got a chance. Ah, he went to the waist. When you go to the waist, you take away the effectiveness. It's so natural that when you get a shot, you want to go to the waist around the rib cage, and that just helps with the wizard. The wizard is kind of like an overhook. So you reach that arm back and just kind of hook it. That's a wizard. Stall red. Another shot again. Now that's a stall, stall call red. against Ed Scott. One on each side. No control. And I agree with that. No control. He's going to try and get his head out. 
Has got is holding tight. You see he's sucking no it in. And he's trying to get that leg out on neutral dangerous. He's in a good position to get a takedown. Travis is in a really no strong control. position. He's got to get that right arm out. No control. That right arm has got to slide out. And Ed Scott is holding tight. Nothing yet. Look at the defense here. Looking for neutral danger. No control. Nice scramble here. And Scott has done a great job to avoid the neutral danger. But there, after hard fought work from Travis, is the three as he takes the lead. And that was hard fought. Short time, very important that Teague Travis stay on top. Big time takedown by Teague Travis here. He leads it 3-1 after two. Pat Papalicia, one and six against Oklahoma State as a head coach. And we talked about he's facing his mentor, John Smith. His college coach, going back to the beginning of when they started to square off, Papa Lee's you said, you're just trying to show the work you've done, but the longer you've been around, it becomes just another duel because he knows that John Smith, 33 seasons in, is the longest tenured coach in the sport, is just as competitive as a coach as he was as a wrestler. That has not changed about John Smith. So decisions need to be made here by Ed Scott. How long is he going to try and keep T. Travis down? He's down by two. T. Travis is continuing to work up, and he's getting a reversal. I'll tell you what, John Smith said this Travis, he's tough. Man, this is good. At 5-1 with 127 to go. And he's putting some life back into the Oklahoma State corner. Yes, yes they are. They, they are they're really just willing, Travis to continue to wrestle as hard as he is right now. Because if Travis gets a win here, that sets them up to feel really good going into 65, where they've got the number two wrestler in the country of Isaac Olenek on deck. Work center! Going back. Travis is wrestling a really smart match here. Not putting himself in bad positions. And it seems like every time that Ed Scott goes to reach, he's doing a sweep single. Sweep single meaning outside. Uh, he went to that again. He shot for the right leg, and then he went to the left leg. This time, Ed Scott has good defense here. Now he's going to look for a cradle. Right in time, not a factor. And it's tied up on the takedown by Scott. Here's willpower. Whose will is stronger? Is it going to be the will of Travis to get out? Or is it going to be the will of Ed Scott? It looks like Travis has got the reversal. Travis does it again. Two more. 30 seconds left. It's short time. Team Travis. Coach Smith said he's tough. Mental toughness is not just as important. Look at this. He's got a wrestle smart. Short time. Is there going to be magic in Reynolds again? Team Travis. He's going for it. Snap downs. Spin behind. T. Travis is going to upset the All-American. Yes, he has. T. Travis hangs on and by one defeats fifth-ranked Ed Scott to get the upset and vault Oklahoma State back in front. Good, hard wrestling. T. Travis, probably the biggest win of his career. These guys wrestled really hard. As I said earlier, here it is. We're looking for the cradle. And at that point, it was all, am I going to give up? No, T. Travis said, I'm getting out. I don't care how. It doesn't have to be a move. I've just got to move. And at this point, Ed Scott gets a little high, and there's a reversal. And that seals the match. Look at that. And he's going to look at him. He's going to stick the tongue out. <laughs> Oh, it's like he's watched a match or time or 